How's it going, Ready Up Live? In the latest episode of Hunt the Truth, Ben has been hiding in the shadows since he hacked into the peace meeting. Mashak still hadn't shown up. Andrew Del Rio is now a freshman senator. He addresses the public telling them that the Spartan 2s are fundamentally flawed and an embarrassment. He vouches for Spartan 4s, saying that they are actual people. Somebody broke into where Ben was hiding. His friend Ray. Ray found an official transmission from the Sangheilis to the UEG. Calling Chief the Demon, they explained that he wasn't responsible for the attacks. The planet Biko has been completely cut off from communication for a while. It's getting ugly. Protests, martial law, the works. The government of Biko have been trying to explain that Chief wasn't responsible, but Earth's government gave them a gag order. Undercover investigations showed that a group called Sapien Sunrise was responsible for the attacks. Extremists who think that humans are pure and aliens are bad. There were apparently nine Sapiens at the peace talks. Those were the people that the chief killed. They weren't innocent. He didn't kill a single innocent. He was simply saving people. They were going to attack, but he got there first. Ray wanted Ben to call Petra. She told him she had a lead. Coordinates coordinates to something important, it just isn't clear what. As Ben stopped hiding and went to go gather his money and supplies from his apartment, he saw something strange. Notices on the door. Condemned. Unfit for human habitation. His key still worked though. Every apartment door was open, except his own. He opened the door and everything was gone. It was completely destroyed in there. Nothing was left. So the campaign against the Spartan 2s has begun. That condemns both Master Chief and Blue Team. It seems like this is the reason Locke is sent after them. And Del Rio, that guy. God, the, so easy to hate. He's so easy to hate. So what do you think will happen next? Leave your thoughts in the comment section below, smack that like button, and subscribe for your best source for Halo news. We have a newly confirmed member of Locke's Spartan team. This is Spartan Tanaka. Tanaka worked with her father on a mining operation on the planet Minib.